Hi, I'm Diane Cometa, and today on Dishing with Di, I'm going to show you how to make grilled eggplant parmesan. This is a healthy version of the traditional, and you don't have to heat up your oven. You can just go right outside and use your grill. So let's get started today on Dishing with Di. You need some fresh eggplant some fresh or jarred tomato sauce, some shredded mozzarella cheese, some fresh grated Parmesan cheese, and some panko breadcrumbs. You also need some salt, pepper, and olive oil, and you need a baking pan. Now this is a nine by nine pan. You can use an eight by eight as well, but do not use a glass pan because we're gonna be taking this and putting this on the grill, and I'm not certain, but I think that could shatter, so you don't wanna take the risk. So use something that's gonna be safe, and the first thing that we're gonna do before we get out to the grill is take our eggplant and remove the skin. Now, my husband prefers no skin on his eggplant Parmesan, so if you'd like to leave it, you very well can, or you can take part of it off. So what you're gonna do after you've removed the skin is take it and slice it lengthwise, straight down, and you wanna make it about a quarter to a half an inch thick, just like this. Now, what I usually do is I cut the bottom off so it's nice and flat, and then that way I can just go straight down. Now, I have um, cut the skin off already, and I did that with this knife. This is actually a bread knife, and it's easier to cut it off with a knife than it is to try to peel it with a potato peeler. So just um, you know, be sure you do it with a knife instead if you wanna take it off. It'll save you some trouble. And I'm just gonna continue here and cut the rest of this down. I'm putting my eggplant onto a sheet and I'm brushing each piece lightly on both sides with some olive oil. And then what I'm gonna do is take a little bit of salt and a little bit of pepper and do that to each one. My grill is preheating and now I'm gonna take out my eggplant and get things started. I'm placing my eggplant onto my preheated grill and I'm gonna cook them until they get nice grill marks and then I'm gonna turn them over to the other side. Now I'm just gonna close the lid and let those cook and then I'll show you what they look like and what we're gonna do next. My eggplant is mostly done. It's been about six minutes total. So you can see there's nice grill marks on them. I have my little baking sheet here and on top of that I put my baking pan and into that I'm gonna sprinkle some of these panko breadcrumbs. And that's just gonna coat the bottom of the pan and make it like a little bit crunchy down there. And then I just drizzle a little bit of olive oil in and just kind of toss that around. And spread that out nice and evenly. And put a layer of eggplant right on top of the panko breadcrumbs. Just try to fill in all the gaps. Now take some of your sauce and put that on and just spread that out nice and evenly. And now take some of your mozzarella cheese and sprinkle that over it. And just keep doing that until all your eggplant is gone. All my eggplant is in there and now I'm gonna take the remaining panko breadcrumbs and that freshly grated Parmesan cheese and I'm gonna mix that together in this little bowl here. A lot easier than doing it in the kitchen. So now I'm gonna take this mixture and I'm just gonna sprinkle this right on top of the eggplant. And this is gonna make it nice and crispy and just get it all really coated well. And then we're pretty much done. Just spread that out. Now I'm gonna take this and put this onto my grill on the baking sheet, close the lid, and let that cook until it gets nice and bubbly and the top gets a little crispy. So that might take about 20 to 30 minutes. It's important to have a baking sheet under your pan in case it starts to bubble up. You don't want it bubbling over into the grill. So I'll show you what this looks like when it's done and I'm gonna go sit down and relax. And here it is. I just took it out of the pan. I let it cool for a little bit. You can see the nice layers in there. And now I have to get a taste of this. Eggplant Parmesan is one of my favorites. 
look at that. Nice and cheesy in there. There's some ooey gooey cheese. Can't wait. All crispy on top. Mmm. Crunchy. Mmm. Not missing the fact that it's not fried either because you have that crunch and the sauce and the cheese i'm telling you this is like a real winner this is nice you know if you're trying to watch your calories but also just for the convenience my kitchen is nice and cool i didn't really dirty much up and i was out relaxing outside while that thing was cooking so this is really easy you should try it the recipe is on my website dishingwithdye.com and don't forget to subscribe to my channel i'd love to have you I look forward to seeing you next time, and I hope I made your life a little easier, more enjoyable, and delicious. Bye-bye now.